Break-even inflation expectation rates are calculated by subtracting the yield on inflation-protected treasury bonds, TIPS, from the nominal yield of the same duration standard treasury bond. Now, these rates are a common way of measuring what the market's view is on the future path of inflation. Well, since January 1st, five-year break-even rates have jumped from 2.35% to 2.65, signaling that over the next five years, inflation is expected to run at approximately 2.65%. Although the reasons for the jump are varied, a common theme has been that the policies of the new administration, when they're eventually implemented, may be inflationary. Of course, tariffs are on the top of the list of concerns, but other elements like deregulation, corporate tax cuts, and even a policy consideration of reimbursing taxpayers a percentage of money saved through the Department of Efficiency are all being viewed as potentially inflationary. This narrative has been added to an already troubling path of inflation that's seen the CPI data tick up to a last reading of 3% year over year. There are a couple of interesting anomalies surrounding the recent talk of inflation resurgence though. Yields on both five-year and 10-year US treasuries have come down, indicating strong demand. Now in a normal inflationary environment, we'd expect the opposite because inflation eats into the return on fixed rate bonds. But perhaps most interesting, is that, according to the CME FedWatch tool, the Fed is still expected to continue with rate cuts over the next 20 months, despite the market saying that inflation is not over.